Okay, what? 270 some meters. This nigga just drifted that thing. He drifted it. You think I'll cross and take my mans out? Just kill yourself in the trenches. 40 on my hip. I had to fix my. Roller skating covered in a million bees what the and a heck? record so impossible it will never be broken. Those are just a few of the 22 unbreakable world records included in this video. No, bro. Oh first, we got well, some yeah, of more strength than a single finger oh, than yeah, most yeah, of us have in our two arms there. combined. This guy broke the record by doing 45 one finger push ups in 30 seconds. What? Damn. Okay, they didn't tell us that. Hands registered as second, lethal weapons. I think so. But if you thought having strong fingers was impressive, no. imagine hey, the strength almost. and flexibility needed to pull what? this off. What? What? How do you even figure out you can do something like that? That freaky ass kid! <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute, what the fuck is that dude doing? So uh, what what possessed you to get that low? What, How do you even push your limits to, no, to find no, this talent? No, no, that's what I'm saying. Like, what did you try? The game of Limbo and got inspired too much? You took you Bro did Limbo with skates and said, this is my new talent. Bro won. Bro, Bro had to win the Limbo. Got inspired by Limbo and took it the, to the highest passion ever, dog. Freaky. It's like discovering you've got rubber bands for bones oh, and wheels for enough. feet. But not only did he do some he's serious multitasking, he's he also limbo skated 145 meters beneath poles just 30 centimeters high. I mean, he basically man. just morphed himself into a vehicle. He's not the only one working wonders on wheels, though. Because for anyone who drives... Yeah, I could have me on roller skates, so yeah. He wonders ah. like a personal attack. What? Ooh, get busy! Meaning to say there's people out there parallel parking themselves into the record books? That, that space was only eight centimeters either side. I'd need that tripled at least. Nigga, what? And he if you thought those wedges were tight. Yeah, Dude Perfect set out to beat the world's highest fastball shot from the 108th floor of the Strata. The only problem? Each failed attempt was like a projectile hurtling down to Earth. And there were a lot of them. Is that where we see you, sir? Watch the car, watch the... Oh, <laughs> that's gonna leave a mark. But after four days and 25 hours of total attempts, this is the world's highest basketball shot. I would've known it, though. They finally suck it in from 856 feet up in the air. But hey, they're not the only ones playing with gravity. Whoa, whoa, man, because here's a truck that looks more comfortable so airborne. What? Wait, and on? wheels on the ground. You got springs or something? What better reason is there to build an entire town than to launch a pickup truck 379 feet over the length of it? I know they say Red Bull gives you wings, but have they been replacing the gas hell. with it too? Like a video if you game, don't have wings, it? or like arms for that matter, yeah. then having feet like he does is the ultimate superpower. Jordan! Jordan! How is he pushing the pedal? Jordan! If he drift, I'm out. Jordan, I promise you, if you do anything, how is he pushing? Essentially, he's using his other hand to push the pedal? Jordan, stop. stop. If he drift, I'm leaving. Nigga, I promise That's a you. promise, not a I, warning. I promise you. I promise you. It's done for. If he drift, I'm out. The video's done for. Everything's done for. And he's not just a hands free driver. He's stop. A stop. 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 Regular, that's not regular. That's not regular things. This nigga just bro used got half a sock on. Bro, oh, bro got Jordan. half a sock. Bro Jordan. got to his toes out the Come on, grip. dog. He tore his sock bro on his toes out toes out he the grip for grip. Tore his sock on purpose. Bro, bro. Appreciate the said. sub, bro. He tore his sock on purpose. Some niggas be getting their holes in socks, bro. He did it purposely. What the fuck is wrong with this dude? Bro, go back, bro. There's no way he just did that. Whole, I'm getting out yeah, the car if you're doing that. Flight. I'm getting out the car if you're doing that, dog. Bro, he is chicken. Drifting 172 miles per hour this, isn't for the faint heart. This man's got twinkle toes to do it. Damn. And while most drifts are over after a couple seconds, what happens when it lasts eight hours? Uh -huh. Without even stopping about? once? To break the record. Wait, wait tell me, bro, drifting for a whole school day? A whole school day? A whole shit. The team over at BMW wanted to complete the longest vehicle drift in existence on a never-ending donut. Not the sweet kind, though. Because on the 200... I had a never-ending crush. 
So this is not. This is actually not. I'm just not surprising. We never ending it. You're sitting here watching this right now. I'm crushing him about how. 23 uh, miles so five fuel refills were needed over the course of the day. And if you're wondering how they Wait, refueled, what? They, didn't didn't refuel. Refuel. they didn't stop for that either. Well, you being so weird. Eight hour long drifts, driving with feet, and jumping over a whole freaking town. But what if we raise the stakes and switch up the vehicle a little? What the is that fuck? snowboard? What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? What the the fuck? What the the Smashing the distance snow. for the longest snowmobile Man, jump with 412 feet. It's hard to believe that this is even real. Please, how did I get stuck? But just like a snowmobile doesn't belong in the air, what in the world is this dude anywhere doing? near the road either? Why is he in and sure, time? circus gymnastics can be this cool. But why don't we put these acrobatics to a real test by putting their lives on the line? Huh? See what I did there? Bro, you knocked on your two. last mission in life, dog. Bro, he acting like he on the GTA heist or something, dog. What the freak? Then, then the person narrating will make it better. Tell me he putting his life on the line. <laughs> bro, because he put his life. Because he got it, bro. He's on the line. <sighs> For real, dog. What the fuck is happening right now, bro? Moving cars. But it isn't just man-made machines that can get you. Don't see that every day. Man, just tell myself. You don't see unicycles like this every day <laughs> either. <laughs> I mean, look at that thing. It's basically sightseeing on the move, except with a lot more anxiety. I want to do something that no one else, you know, no one else in the world's doing. But if unicycles oh, like weren't already awesome daring shit. enough, here's a 30-foot tall one called the Tower of Death. Whoa. And I don't know about you, but I'm not going near what? anything that has the word death in its name. What's more? Who this attempt this was deemed too crazy to be officially bro, weaponized. Bro, is he going around cones? Bro, Jordan, he's doing drills with that shit. Nigga, bro, come on, dude. Just get in the car. Just ride a regular bike. You want to just see... You, what do you want to see from a bird's view? Bro, I don't like this. Bro, come on, bro. Just be satisfied with your regular bike you bro, got. just go on a plane. Helicopter. Something. Something, something dude. Something. Organized. That alone speaks for itself. What the but if you thought that sounds crazy, this guy the with the fuck? speed Jordan. of a car, Jordan. what is that he got on, the on a skateboard down a hill without a anything strapping him down? On the it. It's just the fall. one tiny rock oh, or pop at 90 miles per hour and it lights out. He I don't know, Literally, he one rocket destroyed the whole operation. That wasn't operation. the case, though. What's on the back of his foot? That's what I'm saying. 90 miles per hour. Oh my god. This next guy wasn't content taking the safe roads in life either. You see, thing? a regular day at work for him involves <laughs> high diving into the most shallow pools of water. Why are you constipating? Wait, what's that? You know, you're thinking high and shallow a kid's definitely pool, by don't the way. belong in the same sentence. But check this. Bruh, you're gonna Look hit it. the ground. This water's not gonna stop you. You, you Bro. see how high he's jumping? Bro, he's do you understand? I jump, I literally... Off the roof into tidal water. So how the well, how can this how can this scare me? How can this scare me? Free. Play the video. He just dove from 36 feet into 30 centimeters of water. That seems like a recipe for the worst face plant possible. So he crashed they don't call him Professor yeah. Splash for nothing. But something tells me this guy's anything but a professor. This is the most dangerous thing. What I ever done. It's not just me who double checked the seatbelt on roller coaster rides, right? You know, just in case. Well, this guy checked everything. Uh uh. And made uh -huh. sure to ignore them completely. Then he ditched ticket. the seatbelts, as well as the whole seating arrangement and carriage, and went fully solo on his skates. With each hill, the speed builds. Oh, 15, geez, 6 that, yeah. miles an hour. With each turn, the punishing G's he get harder the to fight. He's lost so. the plot. Somebody stop him! <laughs> and since we're on the topic of having cojones of steel, crazy, we gotta bro. talk about the human cannonball. What? Warning. This is a trained professional in a controlled environment. Wait. Do not attempt. Get in that, right? Like seriously, leave this stuff to the pros. I mean, this gives a whole new meaning of firing live rounds. And if the human ammunition part wasn't crazy enough, oh, well, he also no. blasted himself through if a ring fire... of fire. Boy. Let's be real. A stunt like that would even scare Johnny Knoxville. Shit. Oh, that looked a little easy. But something Knoxville would... Wow, you missed that, that nigga was amazing. Damn, that nigga get hit by the fire, though. It'll probably be burn. What the fuck? He might gotta pull it. He might gotta, uh... Ever dream of attempting Fireproof is taking uh, on bees. Many, okay, no, nigga. Deal breaker. Now you losing me. Deal breaker. He got a cigarette in his mouth. Bees this nigga losing his life, bro. 
So it's estimated Gao's body was covered by about 1.1 million bees. 1.1 1. 1. 1 million bees? 1.1 million? Bro, I'm not, I can't even be around one. That's what I'm saying. So this, He's around one bro, million. He's only camouflaged with it. He's dead. He's like the shit on Call of Duty. Bro, he look like Jeepers Creepers. <laughs> bro, what the freak is happening? Here? He's trying to blend in with bees. He want to fill a he want to fill a bee life. What bro. are you doing, bro? You ain't human. Just accept you that. Just bro, I can't even be around one. This bee. is so one cool. bee, bro. How, bro? Can you find something else? Just, can you break, 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 break another record? Like, stop doing. Why you gotta do this, dog? Bro, imagine getting stung by one point million bees. There's no I way you gonna live. I crash out. I crash out. There's no way you gonna live, bro. Candy I'm gonna turn into Genghis Khan or other bees. Bro, I'm gonna be a bee so bad, bro. Nah, no, this is crazy. But this guy this decided to cover man. himself from head to toe in over a million of them. Being niche when it comes to breaking <laughs> records can go a long way. way. But this is going overboard, isn't it? Oh my, bro, come on, bro. This is Probably crazy. not as overboard as the records this coming up there. Like bro. this wingsuit flight huh. through a cave. What the hell? Jumping from a plane without a oh, parachute. Shit. And a record so huh. out of this world. Wait. I might get in trouble for Wait, showing you. I want a parachute. But look, it's, it's whether you're the world's first at that or at this, let's not discriminate, guys. Both bro, are as impressive as the other. What? Did he just face jump into another plane? Wait, huh? Jesus! A million bees was terrifying, but face jumping into a moving hey, plane mid-flight is on, insane. Bro. That landing did look nice, though. I bet James Bond and Tom Cruise are taking notes. But here's something that could never make its way to the silver screen. When it comes to having pinpoint accuracy, people usually think of hitting targets. But the point here was two tunnels. And his pin was a plane. Now Bat's having tunnel vision. He just brought a GTA stunt into real life. I hope this guy knows there is there's no GTA. respawning in the real world. That is a show on GTA, bruh. Ain't no freaking way, dog. Okay, enough of the games. This right here is a two meter cave. And he intends to fly through it. And not just with some remote controlled drone. No, 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 no. That would be too easy. He's putting on his wingsuit and channeling his inner Superman. Bro. Okay, he, he didn't want to be a this bird might just so be bad. one of the few times where wearing a helmet is completely useless. But when you can fly through the air this skillfully, there's no such thing as a gap too tight. But what's more intense, that or this? Anyone 172 feet high up would usually need to be attached to some sort of safety harness. But what if I were to tell you he's not just taking in the views, he's going to become the view. Oh my god. What the? He's moving a little too fast. And I don't know about you, but I think anyone who's prepared to dive about 105 feet per Man, second hit the deserves the medal of bravery. No, but there's no trust fall out there quite like this one. The most important thing to remember when you go skydiving is definitely a parachute. But he deliberately left his behind and went solo 25,000 feet from the air. Oh, Seriously? Out. Who comes up with this stuff? And fuck? even more, who approves them? Wait, wait, this wait. is one thing you do not want to miscalculate. But right look, perfect accuracy. Bro, but if you didn't get nowhere near that boy... Are they Egypt? Like all right, guys. Now it's time for the moments you've all been Don't waiting for. Out, the Is number space? one Don't. most insane record that will never be Don't broken. Make you I'm talking about something so crazy he wasn't even sure he'd make it out I in one day. See the earth. This shit like a video game, dude. I can see the earth. Did you see the earth, bro? Yes. Yeah, so why the freak is he outside the earth? Get him back in the earth. <laughs> so crazy he wasn't even sure he'd make it out in one piece. The only possible thing that can top jumping 25,000 feet no, no, out of a plane a without a parachute yet. is free falling from space. Just, that At approximately 39 kilometers into the stratosphere, not only did he become the first person to free fall from space, he also became the first to break the speed of sound on his way down and live to tell the tale. Now that's one giant leap for mankind. Wait, so that nigga had enough time to think about his whole entire what he was gonna do for the rest of the month, nigga. Bro, that was a long ass fall. That's a long ass, bro. Imagine, bro. You know how, bro? I can't even do the, the falls on a roller coaster. Bro, that shit was. Imagine so falling from, imagine falling back on Earth, bro. Imagine jumping from Earth from from, from, from space, bro. Oh, what I'll be thinking about. 
As long as I have Tyler and Ruby with me, I'll be crushing them. Until then, until I get to Earth. And Tyler's like, okay, we back in Earth. We, we, we can relax. That's not enough time for me. Bro, can you quit? I didn't mean to jump from Pluto. Bro. Yes. Stop. It's insane. Free. Because I found you. I jumped from Pluto to Earth off straight bird. Bro. <sighs> what is he talking about? Off straight bird, bro. Bro, what are you talking about right now? I said off straight bird. <laughs> You know what record you could break right now, though? Yeah. The fastest person to click the like and subscribe button. Uh, okay, rap. Let me crash out. Let me crash. I'm tired, but these world records are gonna have me crash the freaking heck out. Heard you want to talk to them, I heard that you trying to get involved with it. Heard that you trying to come by.